Hi, this is Asin. You are now watching Asin Math TV. Today, I would like to share how to create box plot in SPSS. First, click on Frost, Chart Builder, OK, choose Box Plot, double click on the type that we want, move the variable of interest to X axis. This variable must be numerical. Click on Titles or Footnotes. Click and type the title under contain. If you think that the name is too long, we can make use of second line. Apply and click on OK. And we should obtain the box plot that we want. As we can see, there are few circles here. These circles representing potential outlier. And this is the case number, which means that the 258 participant is a potential outlier. If you want to change the design, we can double click. To enlarge the number, we can double click on the number. Text style, we can change the preferred size to a bigger number. Apply and we should see the bigger number here. Also, to enlarge the circle, click on the circle and change the sign. Apply and we should have a bigger sign. We can also change the size of the box. Click on the box, look for box option, amend accordingly, apply as we can see here. If you want to study the title by gentle, back to crafts, chart builder, okay, and we should now back to gallery, box plot, choose multiple box plot. Moves the variable of interest to y axis. This must be numerical. And we want to study by gender, so we move it to x axis. Also, we can add title as we want, apply, and click on OK. And we should obtain a multiple box plot. As we can see, that is extreme. This represents extreme outlier. Circle potential outlier. Also, to change the design, double click. How, let's say we want to add more factors. Back to graphs, chart builder, OK. And now we should look for groups or point. We can add cluster by selecting cluster link variable on X. Move the variable of interest to the cluster. This variable must be non-numerical. We can also add panels. I'm going to move the gender to the panel and move the types of blood to X acid. Click on OK and we should obtain the box plot. If you don't want to have repeated labor, double click the chart, click on the title and we look for panels Click on mirror, apply, uncheck, apply, and we should have only one label. If you want to change the case number, instead of using case number, we can use values. Look for data value label. We just have to choose accordingly. Since this is the body max index, we can choose the body max index, move up, and we just have to remove the case number and we apply. Then the number should be representing the body max index. Also, we can change the colors as which and also the design. Okay, that's all for this video. Thanks for watching. Hope you like this. See you.